Fullback, fullback, run. He's gonna go nuclear. Goodbye. We have freed them. Good job, Commander. Yes! Suck it, Aeon! Hello everyone, Blaine Sarge here. Welcome back to some more old school gaming. So today, once again, we're going to take a look at Supreme Commander. Because judging by how well it was received last time when we looked at the UEF, you guys really enjoyed it. And I'm, we're going to take a look at it once again. This time we're going to be taking a look at a different faction. We're going to be taking a look at the Cybran. Yeah, Cybran would be my second favorite faction. Aeon would be my least favorite faction. In the original but if you go for the expansion uh i like the seraphim even less i i you know i these two are most of the ones i always play with uh all right so like we did with the last video we're gonna just take a look at the first mission showing it off and uh yeah have some fun but before we hop into the first mission let's look at the opening cinematic all right let's do this Oh, real quick, some people were asking uh, why there's a bar there. I don't know. That was part of the original game. Uh, but I did turn the uh, uh, captions on so when they talk, you shouldn't see it down there. So I do apologize. All right, no more talking. Back to cutscene. You spend too much time in here alone, Doctor. I must never forget why we're fighting. Oh, yes. Thank you for coming, my boy. The situation is dire. Oh, yes. The UEF is now losing the infinite war. The QAI. Projections indicate that the UEF will not survive the next major day on assault. The UEF will fall within 42 days. The Aeon consider us abominations. If the UEF lose, the Aeon will turn on us and kill every symbiont in the galaxy. We have survived for the past thousand years by hiding. Oh, yes. Today, that changes. Strategy, my boy. Strategy must be employed. You are now the tip of our spear. You will free our enslaved brothers and sisters from the UEF. The commander is due to load in two minutes. Forgive me, I do ramble. Be safe, my boy. Be safe. All right, so that's the opening cinematic for the Cybern campaign. And like I said, yeah, I don't know how to get rid of that that bar. That's just always been there. So I do apologize, guys. There's no way to get rid of it. But at least now you have the captions on so you can read it. All right, here we go. Replay it. First mission, Operation Liberation. On hard. Let's do it. I am Elite Commander Dostja, Dr. Brackman's personal military attache. This will be your first live operation. You will accompany me to Theban II. There is a large symbiont population there, and your objective is to liberate a small colony in Sector M-13. All of the symbionts on Theban II have been enslaved by the UEF's loyalty programming. We have initiated a wideband broadcast of the symbiont liberation matrix. By the time we arrive, our brothers and sisters will be free and ready to evacuate. 
Unfortunately, the Aeon have also set their sights on Theban II and have launched an offensive against local UEF forces. Defeat the Aeon and UEF armies in your sector in order to free the symbionts. I will engage the primary UEF commander. Follow my orders to the letter if you want to come out of this alive. Wanted to pass along some advice to our new commander. Dr. Brackman, this is quite an honor. Remember what I said. Tip of the spear. And listen to Dostia. She has a flawless record. That is all. Do not judge the doctor, Commander. He is a great man. A genius. He just thinks a little sideways. We gate in 30. Dostia out. Alright. Sweet. Let's do this. Now, some people were commenting in the uh, look, uh, the first video when we looked at the UEF that, you know, it's much better playing this over on FAF. True, but, you know, hang on. A little bit more cutscene. Hang on. The area is secure. Send in the new commander. All right. Let's do this. So just like the other the UEF first mission, it's the same thing, kind of opener. Let's do it. Construct a few power generators and mass extractors. All right, like I was going to say is, yeah, it does look graphically a lot better with FAF, and it runs better and everything's better, but I wanted to show this off showing uh, how this game looked when it first came out. That is the purpose of this series. So I do apologize if it's not as cool as watching as FAF, but, you know, this is how it started, and that's what the purpose of this series is. So hopefully you guys enjoy. Remember to smash and destroy that like button. Let me know you guys are enjoying it. All right, so we're going to get some energy up and running now. We got plenty of mass all over the place that we have at our disposal. All right, let's do this. Now, the Cybern are not bad, but UEF is still my favorite faction to play as. You can ask all the people that are now apparently scared to play me over on my Discord. Which, by the way, if you guys ever want to play this uh, with me or other people, you're looking for games... I do have a group of people over on my Discord that play this quite often. So if you ever want to get a game, either playing versus each other or playing against AI, check that out. Links for my description. Uh, links for my Discord will be in the description down below. And don't forget to smash now and destroy that like button. Factory. Really helps out. All right, now we build an air expanded. factory. Schematics downloaded. Once this is done, I want to build some uh, engineers to go pick up some of this mass and also to expand more and get these mass deposits online so we're getting more mass coming in. Alright. So when I play a Cybern, I tend to go heavy in bombers and air power. So we're really good at it. Let's do this. Uh, so remember, a couple engineers. Build a scout. A couple bombers. And we'll have more factories online because we're going to want to go very heavy into their air assets. They're not really good on the ground, but then again, the Cybern are not really good in general. They're, and they're not like the UEF where they can just do stand-up fights. They can. But they need to use more tactics than just straight up fights a lot of the time, which is, you know, not a bad thing. But then again, you play your cards right, you can still do a stand up fight. I know someone's going to tell me in the comments, hey, the Cybern are not that bad. I know they're not. <laughs> what I'm saying is, overall, each faction has its own special abilities. The UEF is more of a tanky, I'm going to hold my ground, you ain't coming at me, I got big guns. Uh, the Aeon, just use overwhelming force and their alien technology. You know what I mean? And the Cybern are use more sneak tactics in order to win because they can't do straight up fights. That, that's generally the idea. All right. Um, so here we go. At least that's what it is in the lore. Right? We'll get those online. You are gonna come over here and keep grabbing more of these. are 
are coming online. Sweet. Alright, what is... Hang on just a second. I want to see what the game speed is at. I was wondering if there's a way to. Uh, we'll keep it at, you know, that right there. We'll keep it at zero, which is right in the middle. And uh, if it seems like it's going a little too slow, I'll speed it up to like one or two. Because I noticed for some reason when I was playing as the UEF in the last video, uh, looking at those guys, that it seemed like it was going really slow. But then again, that could have been just me. Or I'm just used to playing FAF way too much. Get some more power online. We need the power. Keep harvesting, dude. We've got a lot to pick up. If we haven't have any mass storage, we can be. We need a lot of this. We need to pull here and start picking up this. Oh, to there. I'll forget it. All right. We're almost there. I'm just gonna build, I think, one more bomber and then it's gonna go on to the next bit of the mission. It's not too bad. This, just like the UES first mission, is more of a tutorial-based mission. It kind of introduces you to the faction and the story. I'm reading the story. UEF radar installation to your south. Use your bombers to destroy the UEF forces guarding the radar. Operation area, area expanded. expanded. I can do that, or <laughs> I can go over there and take it, which is what I'm gonna do, because we can use this. Uh, later on, I won't ruin it why, but we can use it later on when we fight against the other faction. The third faction would be the Aeon Illuminate. And keep building for me. Capture the power first. All right, because we're cyborgs, we need lots of power. For we are cyborgs, and we're chipheads. We need power. Leave us alone. Right. There is another mass deposit over there. Let's go grab it, and we'll have that all picked up in just a moment. that up and then the rest of it we should have enough power now come on why destroy it when you can use it for your own right all right now this I got my freaking Ah, oh, those bastards. Oh, 
Harper found the area. Perhaps Dr. Brackman's faith in you was justified. Possibly. The UEF controls mass deposits to your north. They are guarding their position with interceptors, which will easily defeat your bombers. Counter the interceptors with fighters. Once the interceptors are destroyed, attack the area with your bombers. Yes, ma'am. And Operation get some area fighters expand. online then. Okay, so now we just gotta make ourselves some interceptors. That shouldn't be a problem. We have a few just kind of scaring about over there. Probably one more group of fighters before we have enough. So they do have a fair bit. Oh yeah, and we're gonna destroy this. We're not gonna capture this. Ooh, I like that. That's cool. Alright, so he's going there and then there. There. That. Alright, we should technically have enough. So let's see what happens. We're engaging. Took out my inner. My, my interceptors and my bombers are just wide open right now. Uh, fly over my guns, guys. Fly over the guns. Come on. Over the guns. They're not the greatest guns, but they're doing something. Just not enough. Let's go more. <clears throat> That's a good spot for one. And where do we want to put another one? There. Get it, boys. The outer interceptor is not the greatest either. <laughs> greatest uh, actual force for air assets, I should say, or air power, is actually the Aeon. They're the best. Uh, with the UEF being number two and Siren sadly taking up the her. <laughs> well, you got out number these guys, man. Hell, their commander's not even that good. <laughs> but, you know, the Cybern have their own charm, and I like it. So it's not too bad. So I don't want to sound like I'm actually dissing on the Cybern to all those who out there who love being Cybern. It's not what I'm trying to do. At all. At all. The only ones I would ever probably diss on would probably be this, this Seraphim. Because I just don't like playing the Seraphim at all. Uh, come 
fuck. There we go. Commander, my name is Jericho. I just escaped from a UEF compound to the east. There are other symbionts being held there. You must help oh, they them. They have quite a bit of stuff now. You will free our enslaved brethren. Oh, Dostia. incoming. We have incoming. Dostia? Elite Commander Dostia. Correct. I have information that I must pass along to you. Here are my coordinates. Can you reach me? Oh, he better. Yes. Commander, All right, this scans is reveal an outer ring of UEF defenses and patrols to your east. Deal with them while I meet with Jericho. Dostia out. Yes, ma'am. Schematic downloaded. Now we can build ground forces. Operation Why you guys go over expanded. there? I don't know. All right, so what I want to try to do for this bit is actually capture these. Don't care about anything else. Just want these. Reason being, your air uh, forces will actually run out of fuel. And I don't like that. Especially what, later on, what we have to deal with. I really don't like that. So we're going to capture these things. And let our air forces do whatever they can. We're gonna actually bring them back. Shit. Too far out there. We're gonna build our land forces out here, or I should say our factories. I got the bomber's attention, they'll come after him. Commander under attack. Commander's fine. I could take it. Kind of. Two intercepts that guy. Okay, thank you. Commander under attack. Let's get some uh, mobile AA out, please. Thank you. There you go. Fire. Fire those heat seeking missiles. Guys, guys, don't go too far now. Turn around. Get back in formation. All right, so we'll try to at least grab this one. Actually, I would rather have that one. Fly you over here and fly you over. We'll take a look. But we're not doing too bad, I don't think. And I really love the music from Spring Commander. It's really nice. I actually have it, uh, the soundtrack on my cell phone, so if I just want to relax, I actually do listen to it. Yeah, that's not weird, is it? <laughs> gonna take this one what we're gonna want to do is take out the guns and then retreat get away and then use my commander to come and take those yes the Aeon are here so this it's gonna be fun later on no not really all right all right guys come up here grab that Defensive line right there. Kind of deter them. Won't do much, but it's, it's better than nothing. Might as well have, have them do something. Alright, so you guys start 
build me an army. Oh, that's right, I don't get the... Uh, okay. We're going with artillery then. down here I actually I decided to change my mind I don't want that right now Thinking about it, we actually are doing really good on energy. We don't need those ones, do we? Yeah, not really. Let's get you over here as well. Got a little bit of a nice air force going on here. Let's hurry on over and uh, get ready to take out this. Once this is down, we have at least one of these. We can then just go in and destroy the rest of them. I don't care. Don't need the rest of them. Which, in fact, is exactly what we're going to get ready for. A lot of artillery and AA. That's what we're going to go in with. firing. We don't want to accidentally destroy that. All right, Commander. Capture all this. I'm sure build up more energy things right there. All right, why he is doing that, everybody, we're going to get ready to attack these ones. Because all we do is literally just one. We don't need them all. And make sure we don't lose it. We'll build a couple. Actually, it does, it does have AA guns on there, doesn't it? Okay. Right, while he's capturing those, we're going to push on. All that cyber, uh, the Aeon junk. Get ready to push on out. If I remember correctly, I believe the Aeon do come from this way. So we're going to pre-get ready. I 
I can't remember if it was this way or not. But, you know, just in case, we're gonna... It's been a while, so we're gonna make sure we're ready. That should hold them off. We severely hope so. Alright, let's just go and bum rush them. The UEF outer defenses still need to be destroyed, Commander. Dostya out. Working on it, Dostya. I really am. for the kill. Go to more air forces. The patrols have been defeated. Good. Dostya out. Yeah, we, we still have a few things remaining, Dostya, but yeah. All the defenses have been destroyed. Dostya yes. out. All right. Operation area oh, expanded. It just expanded. Here we go. It is time for you to directly attack the UEF's position. Our brothers and sisters are being held in two buildings on a plateau to the east. A small UEF base is to their north. Several enemy patrols are guarding it. The plateau is protected by anti-air gun emplacements. Assault the position with ground units. You now have the Skyhook light air transport schematic. I recommend you use a transport to quickly move your units to the south. Then push north from that position. Yep, right here. And then we'll Unit push north. schematics downloaded. Skyhook, yeah. Okay, all you guys, I need you to actually fall back. We'll let our bombers and everything else kind of hold them off up here. Because we do have the air staging facility now. Alright, you guys come up here. Grab those. And let's actually stop these. Let's get groups of air transports. We're gonna get lots of these guys. The loyalist. Oh, actually, Mantis. Sorry. Ah, uh, for some, I would call them loyalists. And once these guys are done, they'll be our main fighting force. Those are our tanks. They're spiders. Yay! Because you know what's more creepy? You know what's creepy? Spiders. You know what's more creepy? Guns on spiders. That there is an Aeon commander in a sector okay. south of your mission area. Stay on your guard, Commander. Dust you out. Will do. They have a lot of vehicles over here. You have to be careful. Pick up all this. Uh, I don't know 
why you guys are not landing. Yeah, there's the Aeon. They're already attacking the UEF. I mean, it only helps me, right? Alright, just gotta wait for the next group. Come on, guys. Build. Then we can begin the assault. <laughs> now they're done. Get another group start working over here. Okay. Move you. Uh, let's have you land out there. All of you. Let's go. Oh, yeah. The invasion has begun. Let's do this. Let him up. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Uh, something really cool about seeing a whole bunch of transports going into battle carrying your troops. Ah, uh, so cool. And they're just out kind of range of their guns. You guys could have gotten any closer. Well, first wave is in. We'll lose a few transports. But we're in nonetheless. And we lost two transports. Probably going to lose another one. Oh, boy. Let's get in there. Both through them, guys. We gotta get out, take out those AA guns, or else we can't get any more reinforcements. Alright, more transports are inbound. Bring in more reinforcements. Right on in to the transports. All right, let's do this, boys. Yeah, transports can now come in unimpeded, which is nice. Keep moving. Don't let the artillery get a, uh, zeroed in on you. UEF's artillery alpha strike is really deadly. We don't want that to hit us. Come on, come on. Alright, take out these AA guns. Alright, next back to reinforcements. If Aeon and UEF continue to fight. This is to up our there. advantage. Hell yeah, it is. Let's do it. Keep up the pressure. Yeah, we have a new LZ right here. Bring him on in. Oh, great. Here comes the Aeon. But at least they're kind of helping us out right now. I'm not going to complain too hard, but we're still going to shoot them. Why? Because we don't like them. On through. Let's 
Go, my little spiders. Go. <laughs> LZ, a little farther north. Alright, let's do it. Everybody group up. So they do have a lot of point defense guns up there. We're going to need to bunch up or else we're just not going to get in there. Got to be kidding. Get him, get him, get him. Okay, it seems like they're going a little slow. I'm going to speed up to one. Put him up, boys. guys all just pile into their base and destroy them. Go, 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 go. Alright, there we go. Battle has begun. Focus your fire on that freaking factory. Stop their production. The units guarding the symbionts must be defeated, Commander. Dostya out. No, Dostya. The Aeon Commander is building a base. Wait. The UEF is attacking the Aeon position. The food with the mission objectives. Let them fight. Okay. The patrols have been defeated. Destroy the UEF base. Leave nothing standing. Dust you out. That is not a problem. I received a message from the symbionts. They are safe and evacuating the area. You have handled yourself well so far, Commander. Let us hope it continues. Dust you out. Yes, ma'am. The Aeon Commander to your south is struggling to recover from the last UEF offensive. Now is the time to attack her. Because of the size of her force, I am sending you some advanced units. Yeah. She just, set, she just stung a hornet's nest. Or stepped into a hornet's nest. Shell no mercy. Alright, let's do this. Time to kill some waifus. No, I'm just kidding. All right. So we're going to want the, our rally point to be down here. We have a lot of stuff. All right. Send him down. All right. Let's do this. Uh, you're sending me some more units, right, Dostia? Oh, you already did. All right. Cool. These guys are going to be very helpful. And let's get all bombers. So you know exactly what I'm going to do. I'll bomb them back to the Stone Age. Because they are geez, wide open. Your reliance on technology will be your undoing. I think we got it well in hand. Thank you very much. Get 
guys to have you keep getting more resource or mass, I say, coming in. What do we have for weapons that we can upgrade for? That's really. Go, 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 go with the bombers. Crap. Some of the bombers are out of position. <laughs> on all of you guys, I'm sending you just straight forward to as much damage as you possibly can. The rest of you are you know, more tier two units. You're gonna push in right behind them. Commander, you're gonna come in from the back and help out. Beautiful boys. Yeehaw! Going right for their commander. Grab get her. There we go. Make a squat. Trouble. Try a different combination of units. Dust you out. Well, I think we're good. We're gonna keep hitting her. Apparently she just loves taking missiles to the face. I'm gonna quickly just put a point defense gun right here. Right, look, look. Pull back, pull back, run. He's gonna go nuclear. Goodbye. them. Good job, Commander. Yes! Suck it, Aeon! Alright, that is going to be the end of this operation. Alright, so <coughs> operation successful from Elite Commander Dostya, the Russian awesome chick, which she's one of my favorite characters. Um, it appears that Dr. Brackman was correct in his assessment of your abilities. I admit to some de uh, I, uh, huh. I admit that I had some doubt, but I'm pleased to have been proven wrong. All symbionts from the, from that planet uh, have been rescued and are being in, uh, interrogated in, integrated into the nation. God, I can't talk today. Jericho is in particular has been most eager to help and has volunteered for field duty cool perhaps you will see him again one day uh, rest for now commander you will be needed again soon very soon soon so that's gonna be the end of this video thank you guys so much for watching hopefully you guys enjoyed this one looking at the cybern and again if you guys really enjoyed this and you would like to see a lot more smash and destroy that like button and if this video does really well we'll go on and take a look at the aeon illuminate or probably go on to another game depending what's we'll see what happens but until then thank you guys for watching hope you guys enjoyed it and if you guys have not already you guys can check out my discord links for that will be in the description down below there you guys can talk with me hang out with me and other youtubers and other gamers it's loads of fun hopefully i get to see you guys over there also uh if you want to follow the channel keep up to date what is going on be sure to hit that bell notification icon so you don't miss a single uh upload 
Also, you can follow me over on Twitter as well as my Discord to keep everybody up to date. What is going on with the channel on those two areas? You can find all that for the description in the description down below. Also, I would like to take a moment to say thank you so much to my Patreon supporters. Thank you guys so much for going the extra mile. It really means a lot to me. Uh, if you also want to help support the channel and help me bring more awesome content like this for you guys to enjoy, check out my Patreon. Links for that will be in the description down below as well at the end of the video. Till next time, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Take care, guys. Remember, have an awesome day.